Hi there, uh, I'm Dr. Dominic from Let's Get Checked and I'm here today to talk to you about vitamin D. What is vitamin D? What causes vitamin D deficiency? And most importantly, what we can do to correct vitamin D deficiency. The vitamin D is a very complex uh, vitamin. It's what we call a fat-soluble vitamin. So you, first of all, you need to have fat in your diet for vitamin D to be absorbed and to be, um, and to be made. Um, vitamin D is becoming more increasingly known to have a very wide uh, set of functions. It was always known to promote um, calcium absorption. So if you don't have vitamin D, you're not absorbing calcium. So we've always known that if you have a lack of vitamin D, it can lead to brittle bones and um, poor uh, brittle teeth and leading to conditions like osteoporosis. But it's become increasingly known that vitamin D plays a really wide role in the body. And um, for example, in digestive functions and also in immune functions. And a lot of these functions are actually unknown at the moment. But vitamin D is becoming kind of uh, a new area of research and interest. The three most common reasons for vitamin D deficiency um, amongst us is number one, a lack of sunlight. And this is simply due to where you live in the world. The second most common reason is if you have any extremes of weight, for example, if you're very overweight or very underweight, this can also cause a vitamin D deficiency. And the third most common reason um, that we see is people that simply don't have enough vitamin D in their diet. So how does one increase um, one's vitamin D levels or correct a vitamin D deficiency? Well, obviously I discussed the causes of vitamin D deficiency. So the number one way of increasing your vitamin D um, exposure is to increase your exposure to sunlight. Best time of the day to do this would be between the hours of 12 to two. But of course you must be cautious in the hotter uh, climes that you don't get sunburned. The second way of correcting vitamin D deficiency is, of course, to manage a healthy weight. This is you know, easier said than done, we understand. But as I discussed before, if you're very overweight or very underweight, you, you may suffer from vitamin D deficiency. So a healthy weight is, is advised. The third easiest way of uh, correcting vitamin D deficiency is, of course, to increase the amount of food that you take that is naturally rich in vitamin D. And this would include all dairy products. If, for example, for, or for any reason you are unable to do this, for example, because of a vegan diet or because you're uh, dairy intolerant or lactose intolerant, you may have to um, go to your doctor or your local health food shop and you may have to supplement your diet with actual vitamin D supplements. If you want to uh, know what your vitamin D levels are, you can log on to our website onto Let's Get Checked and you can purchase what, uh, what we call our basic vitamin pack. And that also tests you for, as well as vitamin D, it tests you for uh, B12, vitamin B12 and folate. Um, if you, of course, if you have any other questions or queries, you can uh, go on to Let's Get Checked and you can talk to one of our nurses through live chat and they'd be very happy to advise you further.